Greetings and salutations to you all my good chums. My name is Richard, this is Gentlemanly Gaming, and welcome back once again to Fallout Friday and Fallout 4 Rebuild the Colonies. Now we've had a little bit of a break from Fallout Friday and Fallout 4. I've been a little bit uh, overwhelmed and swamped recently and I wanted to, I didn't have a lot of time, so I wanted to get something out and I wanted to try and get uh, Grand Strategy Sunday and Crusader Kings 2 in real life finished so that's why I was focusing mainly on that one for the past couple of weeks because yeah I just wanted to get that series finished under my belt all done and dusted and then concentrate fully and move on to Fallout 4 so we are back we are back with Fallout Friday and we are back with Fallout 4 where last time on the show I'm pretty sure we did fire support here with Paladin Dance outside Arc Jet Systems now this week what I am planning on doing is whilst we are in this part of the world I am going to do Overland Station so I'm going to head over to Overland Station uh, then I am going to head over towards Diamond City and I'm going to grab Hangman's Alley on the way round there as well. So we are going to concentrate on getting a few, a couple more settlements under our belts, getting a trader under our belts and maybe if we've got the caps, I'm not sure that we have but we'll have to wait and see, potentially buying the property at Diamond City as well. So we're looking to get a few more settlements under our banner. That is going to be our main aim this week. And then next time, I think it's time that we start building up some of the places that we've already settled. Uh, this is supposed to be like a settlement building focused one. So there are going to be elements where I'm going to have to move off, do the main quests, do some other little quest storylines nip into the DLCs, things like that. So it's not always going to be focused on building. It is going to be an actual playthrough. But the winning... What's the word I'm looking for? Requirements for this game is not going to be based on the story. It is going to be settlement based. And if you're not sure what those requirements are, I did discuss them in episode two, I think. So feel free to go back and look at them. But what we are going to do first things first today is we're going to head over towards Oberland Station, get that quest on the map. I also think we're pretty close to Green Top Nursery here as well, aren't we? So I think actually what I'm going to do is head over in that direction first. Is it Green Top that's in this direction? I'm pretty sure it is, right? There's definitely a settlement over in this direction. So I'm going to head over this way first and get that one sorted as well because this one is all about getting settlements on the map. Now, which one are you? I am fairly certain your green top nurseries right that's over in this part of the world is it not yeah I'm pretty sure that's what it is oh grey garden okay okay well there you go there's another settlement that we've discovered now I'm pretty sure you're going to want me to do a quest for you, clean out the super mutants, Welcome right? Welcome to Grey Garden, darling. This is the Commonwealth's first and only hydroponics facility, run entirely by robots. Fantastic. Uh, I am very, very pleased about that. Uh, we will get you under our belt soon enough, and uh, obviously this is going to be a very, very good farm and food producing settlement once we get it under, but I'm pretty sure you're going to want me to get on with cleaning out the super mutants from the water treatment plant, right? That's what you usually want me to do, isn't it? So let's see. simply marvelous. Most of our water comes from the old western plant, south of here. Such an eyesore. Be a dear and pay a visit, hmm? See what you can do. Maybe tidy up the place. It must be filthy. 
If you can get it working again, I'm sure I can come up with something for you. Yep, there we go. So there you go. So that's another one that we're going to do at some point. We're not going to do that now, though. So I... Oh, you didn't, you didn't mark it. Okay, that's fine. So we're not going to do that now, but there you go. There's another mission that we can get completed and get under our belt. And that will get us another settlement. So we're going to grow. We're going to grow very, very rapidly over the next few parts, I'm sure. But, uh, yeah, just need to cross this bridge. And I'm sure Overland is just on the other side of this bridge, right? Uh, I cleared that out last time, but... Would it have respawned? I don't think it would have respawned, would it? Nah, I'm 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 not I'm not too bothered by that anyway. But uh Yeah, Overland's just over there, right? So let's go and get that one on our map as well. And here we are. So let us go and get your quest sorted out. Hello, I have hey been there. sent here by the hey Minutemen. Yes, they did indeed, yes. Yes, I'm here to help. What's going on? There's a group of raiders that won't leave us alone. Stealing our food and supplies. Threatening us if we can't give them what they want. We know where they're coming from, but we can't stand up to them ourselves. Don't worry. I'll take care of So there you go. And that, they're over at Backstreet Apparel, which is exactly the direction I'm going now. So what we're going to do is we are going to head over towards... Uh, probably first thing we're going to hit is Hangman's Alley. Uh, then we'll head up to Diamond City and then probably head across to Backstreet Apparel. I literally just said it. Go on, Backstreet Apparel and then we will circle back here and get this settlement under our control as well. So going to head over towards hangman's alley now and that will probably be the first place that we clear out okay so we are coming up on it this place is obviously usually really crazy down here so what's going on down here today i don't see anything just yet okay we're all right for the moment so let's start off by looting this little garden centre thing because there's always some good stuff here so we can take all of the goodies there's usually a load of fertiliser in here as well right we don't seem to be in any danger right now so I will not sneak around so much just at the moment nothing in there We are taking literally everything, so... Hello, my good woman. Sorry, I'm going to strip you naked now. Because I need literally everything, I'm afraid. So, I guess that you're led to believe that this person set up a little... Uh, trading place here. For food and goods and stuff like that and then I'm guessing that all of the nonsense that happens in this spot right here is supposed to infer that there's a lot of danger in this area and then they just came through and killed her and I'm guessing they, they would have robbed her but you know everything's still here when you get here so Maybe the plants hadn't grown by that point or not. Yeah, but I, that's the story I get with this this person here. And, and it's also a reason why um, the that little crossing, that side street is as busy and as dangerous as it is usually because it, uh, it still counts as stealing. I don't know who I'm stealing from because she's dead. So the fertilizer's stealing, but the money is okay. But yeah, I'm guessing that's what you're supposed to infer from that. And that's why that part is so busy and noisy and things constantly always going on there. That's kind of a, 
the the meaning I've always got from it anyway. But um, yeah, let us head over down towards Hangman's Alley, and we will get that under our belt. Now I know that I can also head in this direction for the UFO. But I'm not interested in doing that just yet. Is that a land stag? What the hell is this? It's just a random bit of meat out here. That's uh very bizarre. Okay, so there's all the nonsense that's just started kicking off. What's going on, robot? And just raiders, I'm guessing? What are you fighting? I'm guessing just raiders, right? Ah, missed you and did barely any. No, I did. I, did I? I think I missed because I would have done more damage than that if I hit them. Surely. Well, they haven't seen me, but whatever they're fighting is dead. So they're finished with that. guessing it was probably just raiders so we'll, there we go there you are right okay so that was me and I basically do no damage to that thing right good to know Doesn't know where I am, so that's good. Maybe it'll be worth... Not bothering. With this. Right, see so yeah, they're starting to blind fire now, so... We'll move. just letting you calm down and sneak past because I'm not doing enough damage anyway it's also a little bit uh, concerning because I need to take on the raiders now and if I'm not doing that much damage, although that is a robot so maybe with a headshot I'll do more damage Yeah, I think it might be an idea just to sneak past just for the time being. Leave them to their business. Should be okay now. Yeah, should be past that now. Yeah, there we go. No worries. Right, so next thing's next. Let's clear out Hangman's Alley. I'm going to do it... I could do. Do I have any grenades? I got frag grenades. So I could drop some over the back gate. And then move around to the front. Because there's a there's a couple of people that are pretty easy to hit from the front. But there's some that are actually like hidden away in buildings and stuff. So if I drop some grenades over the top initially and then run, I 
should be alright. I think I'm going to do that, yeah. I think I'm going to... Drop a grenade over the top. See if I do any damage at all. Right, so that's one killed. There's two killed, there we go. Got one more, and then I think I'll move my way around to the front. Right, okay, so that's... That's all that done, so what I can do now is move around to the front entrance. And do some picking off that way. see you you're glitching into the wall I'm guessing you're a body right yeah I think you're a body yeah you're definitely dead right so I've got no view from here so let's see if I can get one from round here And then, like I said, we'll make our way up to Diamond City. And I would say this has been rather successful. Up on the other end. Oh yeah, of course. So I need to sneak in and do that first, don't I? Good. I can get up here. It's the problem with this playthrough is I'm playing very heavy. Oh, don't tell me I've taken out the easy guys and it's just the hard ones left. Right, there's one there. Okay, so you've come back. But let's... Crap. Let me... I want to... Get out. There we go. Right, Oof, lucky. Go back to where you were. You're fine. So if I can get some distance... Damn it. Right, are you going back to your spot? Okay. Stop moving about! What the... Right, so he's gone to bed. Right, okay. That's not fantastically helpful. Uh... Saw the other guy in here as well. Can't see them. Okay, can I get you in your bed? I don't know if I can. Probably want to try and hit the other guy first, don't I? I can see them there, probably behind this wall here. Yeah, so I hit the two. I've killed the two easy ones. Can I? No. Okay, I can't get through there. So yeah, I've killed the two easy ones and I've left myself the, the hard ones. Which is exactly not what I wanted to do. Right, you're getting up. You're dead. Awesome. Great. That's one.
Anyone else coming? I'm gonna go and investigate what happened to your friend. No, I'm gonna have to go in, aren't I? Oh, I can see an arm. Yeah, I didn't think I was gonna get through that. Yeah. That's uh that's a that's a no go on the hitbox there. That's a little bit asking a bit too much there, I think, isn't it? Yeah. Can I see you from no, okay. Ah, you're moving. Awesome. I was lucky they were on to me, but they decided not to come and approach. Right, I think there's one more, right? I'm pretty sure there's one more in there. Now, I know that there's also a guy underneath me, right? In the in the tunnel, and he, he throws off this detection box quite a bit. But let's uh, move in and see... What we can do. Damn. Sweet. Maybe they are all dead? There's no one up here. Yeah. So I did get them all. I think that's just that guy downstairs that's throwing me off then. I think... We've got Hangman's Alley, right? Yes. Okay. So we have it straight away. Awesome. Okay, so that's another one under our belt. And you know what we need to do, first and foremost. We need to get ourselves a flag down. Yes, we need to claim this as our own. And I will put it right over there by the door, just to begin with. Ah, there we go. Wonderful. Let's uh, just get some illumination up there. There we go. That is another, another settlement for king slash queen and country under our belt there we go um and again this is another settlement that i'm not really going to do a lot with to begin with i'm not um i'm not going to be building here to start off with i'm not going to be inviting people here or anything i have plans for this one uh along with the starlight drive-in i have very specific plans that i want to do with this so for the time being we are going to leave this alone it's not going to be claimed uh well it, it is claimed but we're not going to be using it to begin with what i do want to check is that um it's okay it's not going to get attacked to begin with yeah we're good we're good it's not it's not it, there's no there's no risk of it being attacked that quickly so yeah we're going to leave this for the time being i'm just going to loot these bodies just before to make sure they don't despawn and then we will head up to diamond city right everything done and dusted for the time being let us head up towards diamond city now i know that we're going to get caught in the uh 
in the crossfire here. So let's get ourselves prepared for that to take out these super mutants. I don't know how much damage I'm going to be able to do. Right, diamond security is all dead. You're dead. So it's one super mutant there. One up top. Ah, damn. Wow, there's a lot. Okay, yeah, uh... I'm going to run, because I might want some help with that. There's a lot of them left. Diamond City Security didn't do anything. Now, I do need to take them out, though. That's the thing, because <laughs> I'm going to be going backwards and forwards past there a lot. Um... So I do, I do want them to be dead. I was hoping I could catch the dog. That's a legendary as well. That's, I think that's my first legendary, isn't it? Right. Yep. Okay. Yep. Hello, Diamond City Security. Give me a hand, please. Right, he's down. But yeah, I'm going to say there's 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 going to be more What are you shooting at? I don't want to go barreling in because yeah. It's going to hurt. I don't know what that... Oh, you're up there. I'm not doing anything to that guy, am I? Yes, the problem is it's still a pipe weapon at the end of the day. Yeah, I'm still using pipe weaponry at the end of the day, so it's still not quite up to snuff right now. But yeah, I'm going to uh, try and take these guys all out, and then we'll head over to Diamond City. But yeah, I'm just going to try and uh, see this legendary is going to take a while. It's going to take a long time to get this legendary down. Yeah, so I'm not going to make you sit all through this. Uh, so I will clear all this up and uh, meet you back at Diamond City. Oh, a lucky hunting rifle off that legendary. That's pretty good. Because I already have Righteous Authority as well. And now I've got a lucky hunting rifle. Not bad. Not too bad at all, I would say. Pretty happy with that. And I'm over encumbered again. Great. Oh well. Uh, so I'm going to have to make a quick trip back to Hangman's Alley to drop some of this stuff off before I move on to Diamond City after I've looted. Okay, so I've decided that I am going to go up to Diamond City over encumbered. It's, it's safe now, so there's nothing to worry about there. And... Yeah, there's nothing that's going to get me once I get into Diamond City. So I've decided I'm going to go up there over encumbered and sell pretty much most of the stuff I don't need. There's a few weapons that I want to hold on to just for the moment because I think that I want to try and grab some mods off of them to put on the weapons that I already have. So I'm going to keep hold of a few for the time being. Um, most of the armor, the Diamond City armor and stuff like that, that I just got off of these guys over here, I don't need. So I'm going to sell that as well and then sell most of the weapons that I have. So I'm just going to walk up there over encumbered. I will see you when I get there. Before old Danny catches on to the bluff. And there we go. So we are heading into Diamond City. 
with no issues whatsoever. Just taking a bloody, bloody long time because okay. I'm so I'm over encumbered. So I am going to get myself round to some of the traders. I am going to get my stuff sold, complete my quest, uh, and I'll probably pick up the Nick Valentine quest while I'm here as well. Just get that on the map, but we're not going to be doing that yet. Well, from here, we're going to head round to um, Backstreet Apparel. Like I said, get that cleared out, get that done, get Overland Station on our side, plant that flag, claim that for ourselves, and then we'll move on from there. Why do we ask the newcomer? Um, her and her perfect hair. I hear there's a bar in the old theater district that's for raiders only, the combat zone. Why are you naked, Johnny? Why are you naked? I am guessing that's something to do with one of my mods has glitched you out, but none of the other ones are. None of the other security are naked. Why is it just you? Stop giving me quests and tell me why you're naked! Damn you, Johnny! Damn you, Johnny! Freak. Okay, uh, right, let's go and clear out some of this weight that I'm carrying, shall we? We'll uh, get ourselves some decent money, hopefully. I don't know if I'll be able to sell it all or not, though. I don't know if these guys are going to have enough money to clean me out, but let's have a look, shall we? Right, uh, also, one other thing as well. I am very aware that uh, Sheffield is here and that I can recruit him now, but I'm going to leave him here for the time being because I'm probably going to move him to Hangman's Alley when I'm done, but I'm not ready for that yet. So I'm going to I'm gonna leave him here for the time being. So I am very aware that I can recruit him in here, but I'm not going to give it to him just yet. Okay, uh, cleared out most of the stuff. I've got a few things that I want to keep on me for the moment because I want to, like I said, try and take the mods off of them and see if I can move them on some of the other weapons that I have. Uh, and I picked up a few shipments of stuff as well. So copper, cork, gears, screws and wood. So a few shipments. Uh, they're always handy to keep on you. Uh, they don't weigh anything, so it's all good. I'm going to drop them off when I get another uh, workbench. So it's probably going to be Overland Station now, I imagine. Uh, we'll just drop them off in there. Um, it's always handy to have. Um, and I'm probably, in the next part, going to start trying to link up some of the settlements because we're going to start probably looking to build up the northwest kind of corner where we started. We've kind of got most of those under wraps now and i'll start to tie everything in but we'll talk about that more next week uh just wanted to show you guys that i picked up a few shipments and that so i'm gonna head round to uh nick's detective agency now get that mission on the road uh and then what we're gonna do is we are going to turn around head into backstreet apparel and get that done for overland station Okay, so we completed Jewel of the Commonwealth, that's fine. I was hoping I was going to get Idiosaphone trigger there, but no, apparently not. And we picked up the quest to go and find Nick Valentine and managed to get the decent amount of money in it. I keep forgetting that I need to try and push for the, for the money because... I can do past most checks because I, because of my charisma level, so... I should be doing that more often, get some free caps out of that pretty much. Uh, should I pick up more stuff while I'm here or should I wait? There's a few more missions I can pick up. I'm going to take their, their crops as well, but I don't really need them at the moment. I think I'm going to leave it for the time being. And I think I am going to head... Johnny, seriously. Oh, Emmett, you're naked as well. Damn sense Why are you all naked? It's so weird. Put some clothes on, you weirdo. Uh, right, I am going to head round to Backstreet Apparel. Get that done. And then we'll head back over to 
Oh, okay, hang on. Oh, I forgot this was going off. So we're just going to watch this happen and we'll uh, we'll go from there then, I guess, because I get some free loot out of this at least. And whilst everyone is freaking out and naked Larry is here, just being in his pants, and everyone's looking and everyone's freaked out and everyone, and uh, Riley is mourning. I'm going to go up. And strip his body naked. Thank you. Bye now. See you later, everybody. Right, now I am heading to Backstreet Apparel. And we will get that done. Okay, so. Let us begin, shall we? Now, hopefully. I've got three shots. Hopefully it's just one each. Right, that's that done. Now, should be another guy outside. Or is he on the roof? I think he's on the roof, actually, isn't he? Yeah. And then it's these two turrets. Oh, no, there is another guy outside. Laban. He's running away. If he... There we go, dropped him, that's good. Now I've only got one shot left now though, that's the only problem, so... Which one's more likely to hit me? I think you're more likely to hit me, aren't you? Can't even take you out with that. Right, what do I have... That can hit from distance? Uh, that's the problem. Oh, I've got the hunting rifle, haven't I? I? forgot about that. I got no ammo for it. Right, okay, great. Hmm. Might be able to use you on this guy. Right, you're down. You're not going to do double damage anymore, but you might be the best thing I have for that at the moment, right? Oh, no, I've got... Any, I've got okay, so you're scoped. I can use you. Don't do a lot of damage, but did enough to get it done for the time being. Okay. So now we're just going to head inside, clean out the inside, and then we will move on from there. I don't think I want to go in with that to begin with. So we will go in with this. Uh, probably loot the bodies first, right? Because they might despawn. So let's get these guys first. Hopefully this isn't going to over encumber me. Because I don't have anywhere to drop off. I mean, I suppose I could leave them in a box inside for the time being, couldn't I? So it's not the end of the world. But I just want to make sure that the bodies don't despawn first. Because that is a risk you always run in this game. Okay, so there we go. All done and dusted. Let's head inside and uh, get this done. So, the problem is, is that I'm usually running very heavy, and I don't have a silencer. So they're going to know I'm here straight away, unfortunately. So I might as well just kind of go in guns blazing. I forgot they had Molotovs. Where'd you go? There. Actually, I think I had some Molotovs, didn't I? So I probably could have gone in and dropped one on them. I mean, it still would have given away my position, obviously, but... It might have been a bit easier. I probably would have come out of that with a bit more health, I imagine. Is this... This has already been activated. Where 
Where's the uh, turret again? It's, is it just round here? Yeah. Come on out. Okay. Got that before he got off any shots. That's good. Now, I do want to clear this place out because obviously we want to come back here and strip mine. So I am going to go up and clear the roof and everything as well because then that stops everything respawning here. But... I'm going to go and complete the mission first. Oh, I Because I'm no as well. Like Actually, while I'm on that, let's quickly... Uh, oh, I do have a frag grenade. I've got more Molotovs though. Molotov or frag? What do I want to drop in there first, I reckon? Come on, it's over. They must have run out. Let's go with the I'll frag first. When I'm ready to fucking relax. Got it? Ah, uh, Jesus. You always were a fucking hard ass. That's why I'm still alive. And since I gotta rely on your sorry ass to watch my back, that's why I'm trying to keep you alive. Too. Hopefully. We had to do a good amount of damage first. Didn't kill anyone. I really thought I was gonna kill someone with that. Right, so that's the mission completed. Yeah, we're done. But like I said, I want to clear this place out. Because I want to stop things respawning here. Now, if I can get it... Ah, damn. I hit myself. I really thought I was going to get that round the corner then. I honestly thought I was going to be alright there. Right. It's you down. Okay, yeah. So I'm going to go and clean up the roof and everything as well. This is just a... Uh, changing rooms isn't it there's nothing there's no one back here is there no no we're good yeah so I'm gonna go and clear the roof as well because like I said I want to make sure that everything doesn't respawn here so we are gonna go and make sure that this building is entirely clear Is it just is it just one more out here or is it just one more here? But that's in here. I I do need to go out onto the roof as well. Cause I know that there are some up on the roof. And if you don't clear out the ones on the roof then everyone respawns inside anyway so I want to make sure that where are you I swear there's usually one up here there's no one here now Okay. I could have sworn there's usually someone on the roof here. 
or am I thinking about I know that there's one on the roof further down this way I know that for sure but I could have sworn that there was someone on the roof here as well but obviously not huh I could have sworn that there was I want to come up here anyway because I want to get the from uh, the yeah all of the stuff from that turret so okay well I always thought that there was someone in there but I guess I guess there's no one up there which means that we're done okay so backstreet apparel clear everything done and dusted um, I'm gonna go and loot the guys in here because I don't want them to despawn. So I'm gonna loot all of the people in here just in case they decide to disappear from existence. But everything else will, um, will wait until I actually come back again. And clear this uh, strip mine this place because yeah everything everything's gonna stay here anyway. I, I, there's no need to rush to get all of the items in and around the place. But yeah, the people they tend to despawn, so I want to make sure I grab everything I can off of them. So I'm just gonna quickly do that, and then we will make our way back to Overland Station. So here we are. I'm gonna turn this in to you hello i have taken care of those raiders for you so can you please talk to me hello thank you really well that's the best news i've heard in a long time by the way we've talked about it and we've decided to support the minutemen and there you go so another settlement that is under our control now i haven't completed this because i need to go and talk to preston first but there we go we have another settlement under our control now what i'm going to do is i'm going to dump everything that i just bought off of them uh those um what are they called shipments 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 that's the word so i'm going to dump all the shipments i got off of them into there uh stick away all of the things that i don't need right now and we will do the most important thing that we have to do here we can't we don't have enough cloth damn Damn, 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 damn. Do you guys, you guys don't have anything. I mean, I could dismantle the sleeping bag, but then you're not going to have enough beds, are you? Crap. Okay, well, we're going to have to come back here because, obviously, we need to uh, claim this for king and queen of country but uh yeah that is something that we're gonna have to do next time apparently i need to grab some cloth from somewhere but there you go so a few little things we added two new settlements to our little realm we went to diamond city we've got some more traders on the board now which is good so we can get some more caps which can lead to some more buying of things some more shipments available to us and we cleared out another location that we can go back and strip mine at another point but that is where we are going to leave this episode for today ladies and gentlemen i would like to thank you all for your patience in waiting for the next episode of this series and I want to thank you for joining me all today. I certainly hope that you join me next time. But until then, I bid you all adieu, a good day, and a massive GG to you all. So if you like this video, please check out our other content. Click on the video below. Please check out this playlist. This is a Rich Tea Entertainment production.